So today let's focus on some finer points of, of focus healing with Maya. And I want to introduce a couple of tools or a couple of techniques as well that will help you along to get your dog into a better focus heel. So first of all, when you first start out, you see in the beginner videos, make sure you use a long line to kind of keep the dog from getting too far. And the dog starts to understand this back and forth movement here to here. She understands where she should be and have some kind of a form of reward, whether that's a treat or a toy or something to keep your dog's focus. So um, the proper focus heel should look like this. Maya Fus. The dog should be right next to me and should focus nicely right behind my left leg and should stay here, my left leg, and should keep this look with very few corrections for looking away. So all that is really nice. Perfect, good girl, Maya, very good girl. The way I'm gonna build that in the beginning, I'm gonna just do a quick review of that, is I'm gonna use a toy, right? So first I'm gonna tease her with a toy, come on. And then I'm gonna tell her, foos. And I'm gonna keep the toy under my arm. Now, I'm gonna get her to stay focused on this position by keeping the toy in clear sight of her, which she can see. Here. And you see she's not looking away. And there, yes, I reward her. And I reward her right away in that position. Let her get the toy. Let her run around with it. Let her get a little possessive over it. She brings it back. I'll play with her a little bit. Good girl. Good girl. Yeah, good. Good girl. And these left circles are gonna really help her to understand to stay back. Right circles will bring her forward. So if she was sitting too far behind me, I would do these circles. Come on, come on. And I would bring her forward. But since she's kind of in the middle, I can do a mixture of both. So I can do a figure eight, I can turn this way with her. And then I can turn the other way with her. And from here, as soon as she's in position, right away I go, yes, and I let her have the toy. She always thinks she can get this toy. So what I'm gonna do here, last time I'm gonna do this, go through this, and I'm gonna show you another tip with the dog, is I'm gonna initiate it, I'm gonna go right into a heel, and I'm gonna introduce another tool, which is, make it, which is really gonna make it worthwhile for you to watch this video. By the way, if you love this video, Check out my member section at robertcabral.com for tons of dog training videos, lessons, and posts, blog posts, podcasts, and everything that you'll really love. Yeah, good girl. Foosh. Right, she's in position. She should be sitting. And what I'm going to introduce is a little riding crop here. And what I'm going to do with this is I'm going to, hey, foosh, foosh. I'm going to be able to give her little corrections for looking down. And now this is not a tactile correction for me grabbing her. This is something that's not really in her mind connected to me. Foos. And I like to carry the crop in my right hand because the dog is on my left side here. And when she's looking down, I'm just going to come across and give her this tap. Good. Good. It's a very, very slight correction. Nope, foos, good, foos. There's two things that I use the riding crop for on the front of the dog. The first one is, hey, is tapping her under her chin very slightly. I'm gonna show you, this is as hard as I hit her with it to keep her looking, hey, hey, looking up, right? This keeps her looking up, yeah, foos, right? Because when she looks down, the tap comes, good. And I want her in this position, good, good, good. Good. Perfect focus. So I keep her in this position and if she were to start to forge on me, I can do this movement here 
and keep her nice and back. All right, good girl. Good. One is to keep her looking up. Good girl. And remember, this is a positive. This is good girl, good girl. The other is to keep her from getting in front of you. That's two really important uses. And if you like this video, subscribe to my YouTube channel for more videos.